Megan's father asked her to feed the pigs on her way to school. He said, Megan, please feed the pigs. Being a first grader can really get you down. Maybe pigs are not so dumb after all. You start to think, man, do I really want to do this for the next 12 years? Well, we'll have to do like math and stuff that we didn't do like in in kindergarten. But the first week, however, brings a different kind of worry. That this thing's going to be tough. Tough? You mean you can't like do, you can't know which number it goes like 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. You don't know which number of the other numbers. I'm going to be thinking I'm going to get all this different homework and everything and everything. Lots of homework. Mm -hmm. It's going to be so hard. Where were pigs here? They were lots You wonder, of will the teacher see your hand before your where, where arm falls off? The door, will the other kids the think you're nosing road. around? Or do you have what it takes to make the grade? Colored paper, notebooks, scissors, a school box. Why do you, you all bring Kleenexes in first grade, Nathan? For, for if it was a cold, cold night and you need to sneeze, need to sneeze, you just put it right next to your nose. Seems grabbing your nose and holding your breath would probably be more fun. Have you noticed any cute girls in class? Um, no, not yet. Not yet, but you're looking. Yes. So what is the glue that holds a first grader together? I very like school because I hope, because I hope I go on another grade. It's the courage to go on and face week number two. Yeah, I'm gonna finish this grade. Bridget Smith, Channel 5 Eyewitness News.